Yeah, good day, my people. And uh, I, I received a call from a police officer from Bini. Ogi that to be precise. It's an uh, assistant uh, police uh, inspector, you know, Ogida. So he has been telling me about the unrest in Bini. So because of that, uh, I didn't sleep last night. So I decided that I want to talk to my people. Because I'm from Ogida myself. I'm from Ego. You see, Edo is not Nigeria. Okay, if there's Brafa, there's uh, Ariwa or Odudua, they should go and sort out the issue. So let me talk to my people. So I will start with a, a quote from uh, Douglas Crocker. So Douglas Crocker said that there's only two ways to have a wetting nation. And they are not negotiable. Okay, only two ways to have a wetting nation and they are not ne negotiable. So one is freedom, one is rule of law. Okay, one is freedom, one is rule of law. So under rule of law, your individual rights and your property rights is protected. Under rule of law, your individual rights and your property rights is protected. So what these Yahoo boys that are protesting are doing, they want freedom, but they don't want rule of law. Okay, but that comes with the consequences. Okay, rule of law, let me just tell you, example of rule of law is Britain, Ireland, UK, they practice rule of law. Australia, Canada, they practice rule of law. Okay, what is rule of law again? It's under, uh, it's rule of law is under the rule of law, under the rule of law, individual rights of properties, individual rights of properties is protested, uh, is protected. So example of that is the British and the American system. So you said you want freedom, but you don't want rule of law. So if you don't want rule of law, you get what they call the uh, FIDO law. Okay. Fido law is what you get 100 years ago in Europe. So the, the best example I can give you about this law, I call it the Tony Kabaka law. Okay, that is Fido law. So you don't have, you have your freedom, but you have Fido, uh, Fido law without rule of law. So I, I, I call it Tony Kabaka law. So other Tony Kabaka law, which is Fido law, which is, uh, is it has already started happening. So Yahoo boys in Benin, you are going to be paying percentage in your money. It, it has happened. Uh, uh, Idaosa said it. He said there's a percentage. Those people that are working in his hotel, he's building another hotel. They're paying percentage in all their money. Young girls doing prostitution, they pay him. All the madam in the world, both Canada, UK, all of them know Tony Kabaka. They pay him all the time. You understand me now? So is that what you want in a do state? We are not, we are not, we are not. The first scientist, the first lamp in the world of discovering a do state. We are smarter than the whole Nigeria. So Edo is not Nigeria. We want rule of law. Obase, uh, sorry, uh, Obaseki is a correct guy. Organize someone to go and meet him, someone you trust, and nobody will harass you. Nobody will harass you, but we want rule of law and we want freedom. But if you throw away rule of law, you get Tony Kabaka law. And you know how Tony Kabaka is. Tony Kabaka law is not a child's play. Okay, let me leave you there. I did a research, okay, because of the video I did. Which I tagged and Yahoo Yahoo. And this was the outcome. I said I should share it with you guys. Okay. According to Kebillions, Kebillions said white liberals tell black people what to think. White liberals tell black people what to think. So who are white liberals? Example of white liberals are black women in America. That's what is going on. Democrat and Republican. They are called they are black women. Black women are controlling their black men in America. So they want to bring that into Nigeria. Okay, they want to bring that. They want, they want to use their pussy to be controlling us. I will give you an example. I read that post and Yahoo Yahoo to do a research. Okay, I have over 50 girls, beautiful girls. Once they block me or they insult me about that thing, I will go and go to their page, take their picture, look at them. Could you imagine? I say, and Yahoo Yahoo, no young man ever attacked me. It, it was always women. So let's continue. So white liberals tell black people what to think. Black women. And we, we, are, we are getting what we call feminism. Let's continue. I will tell you about Abbott. I watched him yesterday. There's a quote he was telling me. He said, as he's talking now, all the young young boys in, in Edo State, especially Edo State, have their cars lined up. So once the coast is clear of them, we bring out their cars to, to take their little, little whore, their little, little girls to be parading in the streets freely. That's what they want. They want freedom. But they will jump Tony Kabaka on the way. So let me continue. 
So, uh, 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 yeah, yeah. So, once the code, yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Former boss, you know, I was watching it, the former boss of SAS because he made the mistake. Because he doesn't know what is going on. On Channel News, what he said is that he said the, the crime, the heinous crime, the deadliest crime that is going on in Nigeria is committed between young boys between the age of 18 and 35. And I'm quoting you now, it's, it's specifically excluded the women. You know, me, I'm an accountant, okay? I have an analytical brain. So once there's a problem, I don't look the problem. I look everything holistically. Where's the problem coming from? Fine, I will tell you where, where, where the problem is coming from. This young man, I've been pressured by this little, I call them little hood. I call them Cardi B, Cardi B and uh, Mega Stanless. Okay? The pressure, I'm, as I'm talking to you now, the latest phone is out. Uh, iPhone 12. Okay? They pressure these young, young people to go and be committing crime in order to buy them this new gadget. Okay? These young, young girls have no interest. If without that money, they don't love you. Okay, I will tell you a lot about relationship. Okay, don't take any fucking risk because of the SAS man is right. Fat, fat is right. The ages is between 18 years of age and uh, 35 committing crime, killing people because of money. Who they want to please with the money? Women. You understand? I read this post. No men, about one or two boys challenged me. They only say I'm not a Yahoo boy. But the main people that challenged me was young, young girls insulting me blocking me, insulting my generation just for saying, uh, stop, yahoo, yahoo. So, you have to understand that we are getting feminist power now. Feminist power want to take over us. As a man, you have to stand as a man and start thinking with your head. No woman love you. They love money. All they think about is money. Don't go and commit in your crime because of any woman. Okay? So, I, I will just give you, uh, you are calling revolution because I don't know, I don't think you understand what uh, revolution is. I don't think you understand uh, the French Revolution. What happened? They decided to kill. The best example I will give to you, they, they decided to kill the thinkers and the business owner of the countries. Okay? Who are the thinkers? The best example I can give you is uh, Tony Elumelu. Tony, uh, Tony Elumelu, uh, according to Times, is not the, the hundred, among the hundred most influential people in the world. You understand? Those people are the people all these protesters will be targeting. Another person they are going to target is Dangote. Dangote is the richest man in Africa. Okay? So when the French Revolution happened, they kill all the business people. They kill all the thinkers. Okay? He draw them back. I don't know. Before they recover, French is supposed to be number one in the world, not even America. But I'm telling you what revolution do. Okay? Everybody I'll be telling you guys, okay, uh, this guy, the Arewa uh, leader, he said anybody try to remove Buhari, said there's going to be a war in Nigeria. <laughs> and I'm going to support them. Okay? If you want Brafa, those useless uh, I'm not the Kano and uh, so what they, so what they did the election, he couldn't, in his own unit, he couldn't raise 10,000 people to vote for him. He's taking advantage of our youth. Hmm? This, I've done a video, there's a way you break a system. Open your political party. INEC is free. We saw the election in Edo State. Free and fair. They are going to give you free. Go and do election. Why are you impatient? Because they are so hungry for power. They don't. They, they, they are not thinking. Me, I think. I have family. I, I'm supposed to be working. I'm supposed to be sleeping. Nobody is paying me. Those people, they are getting support from everywhere. They just want to make a name. So Edo is not Nigeria. Edo is different. We don't want Tony Kabaka. As I talk to you now, share this video. All Edo people enter house. Obaseki is a, is a governor of the people. He will talk to you. Okay? Leave all the places and let people continue. Let Nigeria be crazy there. We are bigger than them. We are smarter than them. Okay? All the, uh, all the greatest philosopher, even the Portuguese can testify to that. All the greatest philosopher, all the, the greatest engineer, the physicians, the mathematics, all was the Portuguese came to jam in, in Edo State. We are, we are different. We are a kid. Of, we are not at the same level as Nigerians. Okay? Don't follow them to full around. Get out of the way and let them carry their problem and go and sort it. Okay? Take care and good day. Bye.